Hi, uh, I just wanted to make like a quick, 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 quick video. Um, so my stupid um, Telecaster, my $60 Telecaster has been through quite a bit of modifications. <laughs> so I kind of wanted to make a discount as cheap as you could do, cooter caster type thing. So I bought one of those acoustic gold foils. I actually threw the magnet, took that out. I uh, took a Strat pickup from a really cheap, guitar that had two ceramic magnets in it. I made it more of a Tiesco style. I actually put a piece of steel in between. So there's two magnets on this. And then I put a gold foil from a uh, from Guitar Fetish on here, which I'm kind of digging. I might be a lot out of tune in this video. I'm testing something out. So I wanted to make, you know, like a cooter caster type thing. And I really wanted to have something with a B and G bender, and you know, for cheap, you can never find a B and G bender. You know, a, a palm pedal by Bigsby is like three hundred some bucks on a good. Well, could be less now, but I bought a Fally Express for this for thirteen. I had to cut where the strings mount with the clippers off the back, and then I went to the hardware store and got some set screws here and here and set the height and that's to set the tuning of what you bend it to and then those rollers kind of guide the string and it doesn't i kind of got it set so i don't have to worry about it binding up here but works pretty good i just looked at a picture of a bigsby palm pedal online and just copied what it looked like i couldn't the only thing i didn't know is if these strings here were drilled straight perpendicular with the top or where the round over goes where the string goes so i drilled them where the like at an angle and then i took a file so it kind of instead of it being like a sharp 90 degree where i could see it breaking here it's like a gentle kind of slope there And then this aluminum, my dad has a machine shop. I raided his uh, stash out there. So yeah, this is my, uh, let's see. Guitar was 60, 30. This was 10, 15, 90, 100, 113, 14 ish, 114 we'll call it. And then probably another 20 or so in little it wasn't 20 it was way less than 20 probably another five in little screws and stuff to get this to all work and then having the scrap aluminum which is another thing i got to put the springs on here so it'll keep tension and won't loosen as it vibrates i i haven't done that yet but yeah so that's pretty cool That's cool. Yeah, so that's kind of a little update. Uh, I, I'll try and post some pictures of what I all did to this thing. Yeah, it's not exactly perfect. It looks like where the little ridge is on the back where the Bigsby logo is supposed to go, it looks like my screw sits right on there. So I might have to do something about that. Yeah, it sits right on that and then it falls to that i might have to take a file or something after that but okay yeah i'll see ya